What's up you guys, Idiot Fliptronics. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to change the IP address on your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus. So before you get into this, you guys, I definitely appreciate if you hit that like and share button below. And if you guys have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Okay, anyways, you guys, uh, normally there's three reasons why you might be wanting to hide your IP address. You might want to access uh, restricted websites that are not, you know, okay to uh, access based on the country you're in. You might want to, you know, have Google not be able to track you. And then you might be wanting to, you know, like pretty much, uh, you know, download movies or if you're streaming movies that are, you know, like still in theaters or whatever from your iPhone, you might want to just like hide that from your service provider. All right. So anyways, you guys, um, I'm going to be showing you guys a VPN. Once again, if you guys don't know what that is, it's a virtual private network. But uh, the one we're using, and I'm going to show you guys how to use it, is expressvpn.com. Uh, so anyways, I'll leave a link in the description, you guys. Um, but I absolutely recommend, if you're trying to you know, change your IP address or hide it uh, on your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, subscribe to this service. It's like $8 a month, but uh, it's the number one VPN on the internet, you guys. And it's what I'm using. So, I mean, I can back up that it's awesome. Uh, and it's literally with the click of a button, you guys. So uh, another nice thing about this service is that you can use it... Um, you can access pretty much anything uh, whether is if you have an account you can you know use it for Windows Mac iOS Android Linux everything you guys all based off of one account okay so anyways I want to do a IP address test right here so I'm gonna type in what is my IP and then we're gonna log into the uh, Express VPN and I'll show you guys how this works so anyways let's go what is uh... okay so let's just remember right now my IP address is that right there um, now, what you guys want to do, like I said, I'll have a link in the description for it, but uh, you know, you want to download the app after you've created an account, and here it is right here. It's the ExpressVPN app. Um, you know, it's very easy to use, you guys, like literally the tap of a button, and you'll be good to go. So it works for pretty much any country, too. All right, so I'm going to click on the app, and then I'm going to log into it so you guys can see how it works. Then I'm going to head back over to uh, Google, and then we're going to type in our IP and uh, you know, you guys will see that it'll change. So anyways, I'm gonna click allow. All right, let's click allow again. Okay, so once you guys are logged into the app after you've created an account, literally all you have to do is tap this button and it's gonna go connected. All right, so the VPN is on. So there's two ways you guys can know it's on. Like I said, you can uh, you know go back to Google and type your IP address in, but you can also see at the top of your iPhone it's going to say VPN. It'll be right next to whoever your provider is. You guys can see it'll just let you know that there's a VPN turned on. All right, so let's go back to Google. And now I'm going to ask, what is my IP address again? All right, you guys can see that it just changed. Okay, so um, literally, you guys, with the click of a button, this will work. And like I said, I, I pretty much nailed the top three reasons why you might want to be hiding your IP address. Um, but you know, I've kind of already said it. I look at this service, um, which costs like $8 a month, as like a Netflix, Netflix subscription for myself because I like to, you know, um, download lots of things and stream them, you know, through uh, my iPhone. Uh, and I don't want to have to deal with like uh, my service provider giving me I'm doing illegal kind of messages. But um, like I said, you can also access restricted websites with a VPN. And then uh, you could have, you know, more privacy with Google not being able to track you. So anyways, you guys, that is how you do it. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, you know, I'll have a link in the description for Ex ExpressVPN to create an account. Uh, please hit that like and share button, you guys, if you're watching this and have not subscribed. Please subscribe and we will see you all later.